Welcome to SnapTix How to Convert from STL to G-Code. In this tutorial, I'll be running you through how to download STL files from a website and how to convert them to G-Code files. For a bit of definition, an STL file is a 3D object file, which is a file format widely supported by many software packages. It is also widely used for rapid prototyping, 3D printing, and computer-aided manufacturing. A G-Code stands for a geometric code. And this is a language that is used to tell a machine what to do or how to do something. The G-code commands, inst commands instruct the machine where to move, how fast to move, and what path to follow. It is necessary to do this conversion in, in order for the 3D printer to actually complete the print. First, you should go to snaptix.org and in the top right hand corner click hardware. We currently have our download separate into modules. So choose a module that you want and go to the downloads column and click the 3D model download, which is the STL. For this tutorial, we will be working with a stretch module. So we'll press the 3D model download. This will take you to a downloads page in Thingiverse. Thingiverse is a website dedicated to the sharing of user-created digital design files. It provides primarily free, open source hardware designs. And for our project, we would like to keep everything as open source and free as possible. Press download all the files button and wait for the compressed zip file to download. Once it's downloaded, you will extract the files like so by pressing save. You click on the files and then you press extract all. And then once the files are extracted, you want to go to files and choose one of the four or how many other STL files are within the folder. For us, we're going to use the stretch module. So now this is the moment that you go to your slicer software that's set up for your specific printer. For us, we'll be using the Prusa slicer in this tutorial. Now, for the Prusa slicer, you will press add, and then you choose, you go to your um, downloaded folder which is Snaptix plus stretch plus module and you go to files and then you press the STL file or the part that you want to work with which is the stretch module. You open that and it will import onto the board as shown. If you're satisfied with the print settings and the orientation of the part then press slice now. Note that for Snaptix modules we have instructions where, where we recommend build settings on the Thingiverse page that the parts were downloaded from. If you're printing from PLA, it requires scaling. But if you're printing from ABS, there's no scaling required. All modules we recommend to provide support from the build plate. Now, press slice now, and then press export G code. You choose wherever you want your G code to be exported to. For me, I'm going to export to my desktop. Press save. After you have pressed save, you have successfully converted from STL to G code and are now ready to print out your 3D model. Thank you for watching our tutorial.